Hi boys and girls, I hope you're all well. When I was little and older, one of my hobbies has been to write poems. So that got me thinking, what could I do during this time that would be nice to share with all of you? So I decided to write you a poem. I really hope you enjoy it. Here goes. Children of Thirlby, I wanted to write you a poem, but where do I start? Well, firstly, and most importantly, you have been in our thoughts since we've all been apart. In years to come, 2020, will be a time that we will all recall as a surreal and strange situation for us, however big or small. When you are older, this will be your history and your children and grandchildren will say, do tell about the time the NHS worked tirelessly to make sure people were well. You can say this pandemic was in my time. I was brave and I was there. Staying safe at home and clapping on a Thursday to show how much I care. On week six of lockdown, as people went out to applaud or bang on a saucepan, a bright and beautiful rainbow could be seen all through the land. Rainbows also appeared in windows and on walls and were a sign of hope. They helped adults and children to feel united and learn how to cope. As well as practicing your spellings, times tables and doing PE, some of you might have learned how to bake, completed a puzzle or loved your daily walks, just like me. Sometimes I'm sure you have all thought that this situation is just so unfair. We all miss our family and our friends, and have beginners cutting our hair. Please don't worry, we will all be together again, learning English, maths and art. We will be able to hug our loved ones a little tighter and be proud that we all played our part. So for now, stay safe, always be kind and true. Sing a little louder, dream a little bigger, and look forward to brighter times that lie ahead for you. I hope you enjoyed it, girls and boys. Stay safe and keep smiling, and hopefully we'll see you all again soon. Bye.